Oh, what's up guys, it's your boy Taco here back with another video. My first video in like months. I mean, it's just a long video. I feel like it's a video. Go ahead and type out back. This could be a quick one, shouldn't take too long to talk about this video. So obviously, I play about for a lot. I mod the game a lot. And while well, mods are cool, sometimes you just, you mod, you want to go up there for a character you want. It's not there, well, it's when you learn how to mod. That's what I've been doing. I'm not really too advanced yet, but I will be showing you today how to make text edit mods, which basically changes the text of characters. So if I change someone's name in the game from Vader to Taco Bell, and you can. It's fine. So I'm going to show you that. So first off, you can download the Frosty Editor, which is the same thing as the Frosty Mod Manager, but it's the editor. Now I get it from the Kyber Battlefront server and newsfeed, and you'll just scroll up a bit. Now, I believe you can get this from the Frosty Discord as well, if you're in that. Also, let's put this link in the description of the video probably as well. You just download this. Obviously, you'll download that. I already have a download, so once you're done downloading that, you'll extract it. It's like, I think I'm check this off. Okay, so you'll download it. You download. Now this one more file and you'll download it up here you'll click extract extract to and you'll extract it to wherever you want I already have it extracted to my desktop in its own folder called frosty address is how I would do so if you want to do that it would be my suggestion but I already have it up there so we're not going to do that so once you have that download go over here to the folder and as you'll see here I do the folder, all the stuff here. You go to the actual application, which is Frosty Editor. Click on this. Click on that. This will take a long time to load if you're first downloading it. This will take like a minute or two, but for me, it's really quick. And this does come with the plugin needed. I know for the alpha version, you have to like download the plugins for this. But this one comes with it. It's just localized string editor. That's what we're looking for. So obviously, what you hear is all the stuff. Um, just do anything you want. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna go to view. Go to localized string editor. And so here it says all the text in the game. All of it, like every single piece of text in the game from like subtitles, the voice lines, all that jazz. This has pretty much everything. Obviously, I'm assuming you'll want to be making it voice sounds for a certain character. So for this we're gonna do I don't know um Dart Darth Vader. As you see, this is Art the Darth Vader Force lines. This is everything. So if you want to change an individual voice individual piece of text, like if you want to change just I don't know freaking this from maximum health to maximum Maximum pussy, you can do that. We're not gonna do that, obviously. You know, we will. we'll do that. Yeah. So here's that. Now, here are all plays a whole bunch of strings. So if you want to change all the text for a character, this is why I personally do. Go up and do a replace multiple strings. And up where it says current values, this is what the text is currently. So if you want to change it, say. This is what I do first. I do Darth Vader. Vader is like, no. Vader's lightsaber. You see the text is Darth Vader's lightsaber, stuff like that. And you can see, I don't know, um, Mondale Dingle. And as you can see in the bottom here, replace 14 instances of Darth Vader's with Quandale Dingles. Click that, do it again. This time we'll just do Darth Vader. Vader, and then just do Quandale Dingle. So why not? Also, I have this setting on case and see. I have this on smart place replacement. This is where it has it to where I change it all lower cases as well, not just capitals. So I'm just going change 51 to this. As you see, all this line's gone. So there's no, obviously, it's just no text in the Vader anymore. So we just go up there. Quandale. Dingle. So 
what they're on. Quandale Dingle. You can see all the text changed. And she works just obviously just to make sure it works. Go up, press the launch, which will launch the game through Frosty the Editor. Wait for this to work. All this jazz. It's just a done launching. If any ears pop up, like I know for one, it said that character was not support. I would just delete it and reinstall it and do it again. Be annoying, but so we're gonna live with it. Went for the game to load, come on. See now, skip this. If we go with the screen here, screw this connection, we'll sell that. As you can see, it has the name changed to Quando Dingle. All the abilities say Quando Dingle. See that's so you know it works. So what you got, exit out of this. I'm going to create a file, click export to mod, and here you'll name it whatever you want, obviously, Quandale Dingle, text, author, you, you can name this whatever you want, but I'm going to do it, away, one, custom, I should have a, oh, custom thing called text editing, whatever you just anyways, save this, and obviously, wherever you save your mods to, you'll want to save this. We'll just name it Quan. I already have a mod that showed up. This was a friend earlier. But place that or make a new one. And that'll be it for the editor. Obviously, you could save the project. I don't know if you had to or not. Unless you come to right remake it, which if you want to, you can. But it's not that hard to just do it over. So we're done with that. Now we can go to normal Frosty. Up these mods. Delete this one. Go to add mod. And we'll go to where we save that mod at. Which for me is in this one. On the dingle text. And obviously it'll be right there in the mod manager, so we'll just go to beta, type this in. It'll be there. When we reload the extra game, it'll be the same thing as launching it through the mod manager. So just to be doing it through here instead of theater. So yeah, um, pretty much if this video here, if you want to see more like this in the future, be sure to let me know. Yeah, this is Taco Art. Make sure to drop a like and sub. If you enjoyed this, learn something new. And yeah, that's it for this one. I'll see y'all next time.